Kelly Cat's back, and she found something really cool. We wanted to check it out with you. This is the Scientific Space Gallery. Look at this. Human voice guides you through an interactive journey into the solar system. Light up sun. Look at that. We are gonna check this out, but first of all, it's made by Scientific. Now it says, right here, little cat, it says, pull out before try me. So pull that out really hard. Pull what? Pull this out. Pull it out. Pull it really hard. Pull it hard. Oh. Okay, now, now push a button. Hit power. Oh, it did light up. Wow. Let's try this button. Wait. Try hitting the sun. Oh, we might have to put batteries in it. <gasps> no. Yeah, it says maybe it. You'll, maybe you'll need this button. Oh. Welcome to a journey of discovery to the depths of the solar system. Welcome to a journey to the discovery the button to begin. of the depths of the solar system. Okay. This is the planet Uranus. This is the planet Saturn. Oh, should we unbox it, Lily Cat? Yeah. Okay, we're gonna do this. All right, Lily Cat, let's open this up. Mm. I'll take it out. I'm gonna slide it out. Got it so hard. Oh, there it goes. It's leaving the package. Yeah. Here's the back. Ooh. Mommy, the, the spiral thing is talking. The thing is talking. Yep, just a second. I'm showing the back of this. This is the planet Saturn. Look at that. It's like the solar system is around you. <laughs> oh, let's take it apart. Oh, look at that. Here, can I have that paper in the packaging down there, please? Thank you. Wow. Wow, look at this. Which one do you think I should choose now? Lily Cat is a science Whoa, nut. look, this one looks like a hot dog. It does look like a hot dog. Let me press it, let me press it. Let me okay. Press it. Oh, it looks like a hamburger. This is the planet Jupiter. Jupiter. Let's check this. This is the planet Mars. Ah. <laughs> you press it. Okay, sometimes it's probably hard. And look at this. When First, let's look at it. Well, look at this. This is the sun. Well, look at this. This is Mercury. It looks like it's the closest planet. Yeah. And this is Earth. That's us, boys and girls. We all live on planet Earth. Jupiter. Well, look at this. Uranus. Mm -hmm. Venus. Little old Mars. What about this one? What about Saturn this one? with the What's rings. This What's this one? That's Neptune. Whoa, look at the Neptune. Pluto used to be a planet, but Whoa. they don't do that this anymore. Is a planet Neptune. Okay. Let me press one. Let me press. Okay. Let me press this one. This Jupiter has been known since prehistoric times Whoa. and is named after the king of the Roman gods. Whoa! This is a planet Uranus. I want to share this. No, this is where we this live. This is Earth, yep. This is the planet Earth. Let's check this one. What's this? Venus is 67 million miles or 108 million kilometers away from the sun. That's or a lot. Or about 70% of the distance between the Earth and the sun. Wow. Well, let's... Which one? Do, I want to try this one. This Neptune was discovered in 1846 and is named after the Roman god of the sea. The Roman god of watch, the sea. Watch this. Ooh, it does. It turns. Look at that. <laughs> this is the sun. The sun is blinking. <laughs> okay, boys and girls. Lily Cat and I figured something out. This is the sun. And then the next closest is Mercury, Venus. Earth, Mars, Jupiter, Saturn, Uranus, and Neptune. Look how close Mercury is. Oh, she took it off. Oops, we gotta turn it on. Okay, listen. Welcome 
to a journey of discovery to the depths of the solar system. Whoa. Press the button to begin. Can let's do a quiz. True or false? One day on Venus equals about 24 hours. Um, let's say true. No, one day on Venus equals about eight months on Earth, <gasps> while one year equals nearly seven and a half months on Earth. Whoa! Okay, let me do it. I'm gonna press the B. Well, you have to press quiz. Okay, listen. Mars's diameter is about A, 4,200 miles, or 6,800 kilometers. Oh my, B, I'm scared. 31,700 miles. Or 51,000 kilometers. Um, Correct. Yes. Mars is the second smallest planet in the solar system. We got it right! Yay! It's about 4,200 miles. Or 6,800 kilometers. Wow, this is so Let cool, you guys. Okay. Let me do it. I'm going to press Earth. Let me do it. the planet Earth. Okay, press it again. Earth Let me derives its name from Old English and Let German. Let me do this. This is the planet Mercury. If you press it once, it says what the planet is. If you press it again, it tells you a fact. Press Mercury again. Mercury has been known for at least 4,000 years and is named after the winged messenger of the Roman gods. Whoa! I'm going to try Mars. Let me go. Here's the planet Mars. I'm going to see if there's aliens. Mars has been known since prehistoric times and is named after the Roman god of war. What does that mean? The Roman god of war? Well, in the old days, people believed that there were different gods at different things. Like, for instance, Atlas was the one who held up the world, the earth. But Atlas doesn't really exist. But that's just kind of the fun stories they had to explain things when they didn't know about all the science we have now. Let me press the button. How to press the button? Has been known since prehistoric times <laughs> and is named after the That's Roman repeat. god of war. Look, you can see the back. You can see the back. Oh, they're listed there. Yep. You can still see these. Mm hmm. Which but I want to press the B. Okay. Was that me? Well, that's just true or false. You have to press quiz and then he'll ask you a question. And you press A for true or B for false. What does that mean? What is B? Well, for? if he says, do you think. He'll say something like, Mars is made of green cheese, and you say A for true or B for false. Like, we know Mars isn't made of cheese, so we push false, because it's not true. What happens if I touch that? Nothing. Ow, oh, 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 oh. oh, it's warm. It's pretty hot. <laughs> it's not that bad. It's a little warm. It's pretty hot to me. That's why you shouldn't do stuff without asking. <laughs> I just touched Okay. Can I do one now? Yeah. I'm going to do Venus. This is the planet Venus. Right here. Now press it again for a fact. Venus has been known since prehistoric times and is named after the Roman goddess of love and beauty. Oh, the, the, the Roman Chinese goddess of Saturn, with Saturn with the rings, yes. This Saturn has been known since prehistoric times and is named after the Roman god of agriculture. Oh, let's press it again. The Saturn is 886 million miles or 1.4 billion kilometers away from the sun or more than nine times the distance between the Earth and the Sun. Are you going to be an astronaut when you grow up? Yeah. I think so. You seem pretty excited about this. Okay, Jupiter looks like a cheeseburger. We're going to hit Jupiter. This is the planet Jupiter. Okay. Jupiter has been known since prehistoric times and is named after the king of the Roman gods. So this, boys and girls, is our scientific space gallery right here. We just wanted to unbox it and share it with you because it is so cool. So be sure yeah. to get one. It's from Scientific. Mm -hmm. It's called Space Gallery. And it's so cool. And it tells you all kinds of facts. It gives yeah. you a quiz. Now, one more thing. Listen when we power off. It talks mm -hmm. to you again. Hit power. The journey will continue upon your return. <laughs> it's so cool. All right, Lily Cat. Say goodbye. Bye, Bye boys and girls. Wait. What? Okay. Like and subscribe. Have a Lily Cat Day! Bye! Woohoo! Have a Lily Cat Day! Like and subscribe.